Hi, my name's Joanna and I'm a first year undergraduate engineer at the Dyson Institute of Engineering and Technology. On a day-to-day -day basis, I'm working in RDD teams at Dyson and also studying towards my engineering degree with the University of Warwick. So that means that three days a week I'm working on live projects for the business and two days a week I'm studying towards that degree. I previously was in a software rotation, so I spent four months um, in software engineering and now I'm in a mechanical rotation and learning all aspects of engineering and really enjoying it too. In terms of the key benefits of doing an apprenticeship over at university, I would say that the primary one for me is that you're learning real world skills on a day-to-day -day basis. So I can see the applications of my degree in real life projects rather than just learning that theory and never really getting that practical experience. So for me, that's really key and it's definitely accelerated my learning in ways that I could never have even imagined. I'd say as well, there's the obvious things like the financial side. So instead of coming out of university with a student debt, I'm having my degree paid for and I'm earning a salary for the next four years of my life. You've got some incredible experience behind you whilst you're, you know, studying for your degree. And you're, yeah, you're just picking up so, so many skills, uh, professional skills that are really going to be important for your career in the future too. So before accepting this apprenticeship, I applied to around 10 other apprenticeships and I only actually received offers from two of those. So in terms of facing rejection, it's definitely something that I did face and there are ways that I sort of overcame that. And I think the key thing is that if a company didn't see the value in your application, then you probably wouldn't be very happy there. Everything's happening for a reason. And if you didn't get in there, then maybe it might be right on another occasion, but there and then there's probably a better fit for you. So you've just got to keep applying, stay open-minded and find the right fit for you really. Top tips, the one thing that stuck with me when I was applying was a piece of advice that I got. And it was, it's not an option until it's an offer. So keep open-minded, keep applying to things and yeah, just be ready to try lots of different things and see if you're good at them because you never know what you might enjoy until you go down that route and you never know how successful you could be at something. And I think there was some apprenticeships that I applied for that to begin with, I didn't think were going to be the right fit for me. I thought that there was better fits elsewhere and actually the way that applications went and the way that my mind changed in that period, I found a much better fit for me. So yeah, it's not an option until it's an offer and that's a key thing I think. I would say the key thing is research. So you make sure that you know the company, make sure that you know what their values are and how that you can really contribute to their business and benefit them in the long run. So if you're, you know, creative, make sure that you're looking at a job role that requires those skills and that you can really give that creativity to. I think if you have the same values as that company and if you have the same ambition as they do, then you're definitely going to be a good fit there. So the biggest learning from my apprenticeship is that you really do reap the rewards of hard work. You have to work harder than some university students, and I'm sure that they may say differently, but personally, from my experiences, I definitely think that we do work harder. We are balancing our degree work and assignments with our, you know, physical work in, in the office, but I wouldn't change it for the world. I know that I'm learning so, so much, and I can see the applications of my learning on a day-to-day -day basis, and I'm not sacrificing anything in my life, personally, I don't think. I'm still having a social life. I'm still enjoying myself the whole way through. And I can say that I think I'm happier than I would be at university because if I was at university doing a similar degree, I would be doing all of the theory, but not really seeing its application. And I don't think that that would be like a very valuable use of my time. So in terms of, of advice for people who are looking at apprenticeships, keep working hard. And yeah, keep your keep your like options open. You don't know necessarily what you might enjoy in the long run, and that's not not an issue. You know, there's plenty of time to figure out what we want to do. But yeah, keep your options open, and I'm sure you'll find something for you. Thanks.